Hey guys, Joanne here with Newegg TV. I'm here to do an overview on this A4 Tech X7 G800V Super Combo 15 gaming keyboard. A couple of things to note before getting into the box. The Super Combo 15, 15 most likely stands for the 15 dedicated macro keys on the keyboard, which I will show you in just a bit. You also get five profiles that you can store onto the 96 kilobyte of onboard memory on this keyboard. It says no driver required and um, um, to, to perform these custom macros. You also get 1000 hertz polling rate as well as one millisecond response time. And let's go ahead and open this up. Here's everything that comes in the box. You get this mini CD, software CD with user manual inside. You could also go ahead and download the latest drivers online. Probably a better thing, a better option. Now onto the actual keyboard, you get about five and three quarters feet of cable, USB 2.0 connector, and with the keyboard, you get this dotted plastic wrist rest, so you don't strain your hands while you type. And this is also a QWERTY layout with full number pad. And I wanted to show you the, um, the keys. So you get a rubber dome membrane underneath. One moment, I'm just gonna take off this T key. This is not included, this tool. And you'll see the uh, rubber dome under there. You also get these uh, drainage holes, so this keyboard is spill proof. That is something that is pretty cool that is included. And also, the WASD keys and the directional arrow keys are both capped in this silicone, this red silicone, so it's hard to miss. Also, your fingers won't slip all, all over the place when you are using those keys. Now onto the G keys, which are the macro keys. You get one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and they skipped eight, not sure why, but uh, they did that. Nine, 10, and uh, 11 is up here. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. So total 15 fully programmable keys. And on the right side, you'll notice the uh, multimedia keys, volume control, play, pause, all that good stuff. Usually I see it with the function and the F keys, but it's nice to have them um, individually set like this as well. You also get two Windows keys. And uh, over here, this button disables Windows. So when you're in-game, it could be very useful. You don't accidentally get knocked out and then you get killed. <laughs> Next to that is the mode key. And what this does is it basically switches uh, between your profiles. So you get a total of five profiles that you can change up the G keys with, and I'll show you how it works when we get into the software. On the back of the keyboard, you get these rubber pieces here. So when you set your keyboard down, it won't shift all over the place. And also, of course, these feet to angle your keyboard if that is what you prefer. So before we take a look at the software, I want to mention that this keyboard does get eight key rollover, which means you can press eight keys at the same time and you should not experience any um, key conflict. So on to the actual software. Here are all the G keys and it could be no setting or any of these settings. And of course you can go to macro manager to go ahead and type out the macros that you want. So you can use the G keys in full force and you can also open up a file toggle between the two uh, the five profiles so to set your G keys and um, the mode select you can change the name <laughs> to whatever you'd like uh, also change the uh, color of the LED that uh, blinks apparently when you are on that specific mode, or actually it is profile. So when I press the mode key, it'll say profile, three, four, five. So that's just a toggle between your various profiles. And this key with the big E on it will open up the internet. So let me go ahead and bring this over. It'll bring you to this page where, where it'll tell you more about the um, software, the editor. And I believe that's it. 
That wraps up our overview on this A4 Tech X7 G800V Super Combo 15 gaming keyboard. I'm Joanne, and if you enjoyed this video, be sure to subscribe to our New Egg YouTube channel. Thanks for watching New Egg TV, and we'll see you next time.